We founded Audio Advisors 38 years ago. Uh, we actually started as a mobile electronics company. Five or six years into that business, as we grew a little bit older, uh, our attention switched from just mobile electronics to home electronics as well. And the uh, two-channel component really became strong when Rudy came to the store. I love music all my life. Back in the 70s and in the late 80s, I had the opportunity to open a small store in New York where I lived. As of Wilson Audio, one of the first Wilson Audio dealers in New York, I approached Dave about selling the whams in my store. There was always energy there. There was always, we're not gonna stay where we are. We wanna get more out of what's capable. Now here we have these incredible speakers, the XVX. And Daryl is involved and he has that same passion and energy. I've known Rudy for a long, long, long time. Going back to my days in New York when he had his shop, Rudy's always had a passion for uh, hi-fi and music, and uh, I think he's perfectly put here at Audio Advisors. At an early age, um, probably about eight is when I first remember really becoming interested in music. It just became something that was embedded in me and it's never really left. I, I just love how it takes you away. So I've uh, been doing business with uh, Jeff and Audio Advisors for probably 35 plus years now. You know, it's kind of a journey with, uh, with music and uh, these guys have been great to work with, plus they're very knowledgeable and they have access to great people in the industry that if they don't have the answer, they know who does. One of the things that's impressive about working with Jeff and knowing Jeff is he pushes things to the edge of the envelope and he gets the most that he can. And he has very little patience for incompetence or not following up on the details that are important. Uh, we have to strive to try and be the best at it because it has to enhance our reputation, but it also has to be fun. When I came to this place, it felt like just walking into somewhere that I had been my whole life. And I was just immediately like, okay, this is, this is where I will be.